we are going to perform a simple physics practical to understand the laws of reflection. Reflection happens when light bounces off a surface, like a mirror. This experiment will help us prove two important laws. Let's begin by looking at the materials we need. We need a drawing sheet, a plain mirror, four optical pins, a protractor, a pencil, and a ruler. So we fix the drawing sheet on a drawing board using drawing pins to keep it firm. And we draw a horizontal line to represent the mirror line. We put a point here. This point is known as the point of incidence. And we are going to draw the normal, which is 90 degrees to the mirror line. So we put the baseline of the protractor here and the point here on the point of incidence, and we measure 90 degrees. We then draw a straight line from the point of incidence passing through the 90 degrees point. And this line is the normal. And it's 90 degrees to the horizontal line. This side is going to be the reflecting surface of the mirror, so we shade the other side. And we are going to draw the incident ray. So let's put the baseline of the protractor on the normal and the point here on the point of incidence and we measure let's say 30 degrees from the normal put a point there and draw a straight line from the point of incidence passing through that point. This line is known as the incident ray. And the angle between the incident ray and the normal is the angle of incidence and the angle of incidence here is 30 degrees now let's put two optical pins on the incident ray and then put the mirror on the horizontal line and we are going to look through the mirror from this side and make sure the images of
these two pins are in a straight line, then we put two other pins in that line. So we are going to erect two other pins to be in a straight line with these two pins in the mirror. So these two pins are in a straight line with the two pins in the mirror. We remove the mirror and the pins. And we draw a straight line from the point of incidence passing through these two points. This line is known as the reflected ray and the angle between the normal and the reflected ray R is the angle of reflection. And we are going to measure the angle of reflection. The angle of reflection is also 30 degrees. And this is the reflected ray. And as we can see, the angle of incidence is 30 degrees and the angle of reflection is also 30 degrees. And this brings us to the laws of reflection. Now the angle of incidence is equal to the angle of reflection. And also, the incident ray, the reflected ray, and the normal at the point of incidence all lie on the same plane. These are the two laws of reflection. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more videos.